lots of sunshine in Cape Town and more showers as well as isolated thunderstorms expected over the summer rainfall regions. It's an interesting forecast, so let's get into it. It will remain cloudy and cold with more isolated showers becoming scattered on a Tuesday evening. Overnight into Wednesday, most of the rain falling over the Kalahari. Rain spreading into northwest and into Wednesday. That band of cloud also extending over large parts of the crew into the western eastern Cape Free State. Isolated showers also expected to reach halting on Wednesday. Accumulated rainfall models are showing in these regions mainly light showers expected of between 1 to 5 millimeters. Scattered showers at first moving over the western areas of northwest as well as over parts of the Free State. A few isolated showers in the forecast for Halting and Pumalanga. This includes the northern areas of Kwebele Natal and a slight chance of showers moving over parts of the Western Cape. This includes the Conrad as well as large parts of the Eastern Cape. Foggy on a Wednesday morning along the West Coast as well as in the Mother City. It will still be a quite chilly afternoon with only 18 degrees, reaching 22 the afternoon after a cold morning in Robertson and 21 expected in Lanesburg as well as Swellendam. Becoming partly cloudy later over the southern areas of South Africa. Temperatures around 20 degrees for the garden route. A northerly wind picking up the afternoon in the Karoo as well as over the central and northern areas of the Eastern Cape with a few isolated showers likely to move in from the north. Windy along the coast with 24 degrees in Port St. John's and a comfortable 25 expected in East London. Mainly sunny skies for KwaZulu Natal. 23 in Durban, Peter Marisburg as well as Ladysmith. A north Easterly wind blowing moderate to fresh in Richards Bay and becoming cloudy from the evening over the northern areas. A few isolated showers likely to move in from the west. It's a mostly cloudy and chilly day for the high felt with temperatures below 20 and also partly cloudy skies for the low felt. Cloudy to mostly cloudy at first in Limpopo becoming partly cloudy with a high of 24 in Lepalale and 22 expected in Tabazimbi. It's a cloudy and chilly day for northwestern icy northerly wind blowing. Scattered showers at first in the west and becoming isolated over the central as well as the eastern areas. Morning showers expected to move over the extreme northeastern parts of the northern Cape. It's still mostly cloudy and chilly with maximum temperatures below 20. Becoming cloudy in the free state with a few isolated showers likely, mainly light rain expected with only 18 in Bloemfontein. Showers also reaching halting on Wednesday. It's going to be a cold to chilly day with only 16 in Johannesburg. Most of the rain clearing up on Thursday. Only light showers likely in parts of the Eastern Cape and temperatures around 20 for the eastern areas. Warmer weather returns to KwaZulu Natal with a high of 24 on Friday for Durban as well as Richards Bay. But cooling down in the west, a cold front making landfall but quickly fizzling out only to bring some light rain for the peninsula and surrounding areas. Well, that's all from me. And remember, no matter the weather, we're in this together.